guys, I'm back again for another video. So for today, I'm going to do what's inside my bag, <laughs> student edition. So I'm going to show to you what's inside my bag during face-to-face -face classes and why I'm still using my school bag during online class. So at first, so this is my bag, this is a Raffles bag, and yun siya. Ganyan siya kalaki, and I don't know, para ako nag-hiking kapag pumapasok. Madaming pwedeng ilagay dito sa bag na to. And I really love it kasi ayoko nung maliit na bag. Feeling ko I'm not ready to go kapag may kulang sa dala ko. Ganyan. So let's start siguro dito sa bag. So first, yan. Kung makikita nyo dito, first is glasses. Then here, syempre, accountancy student. Hindi mawawala. Calculator. Dito naman, sa pinakauna niya, is Dito na nakalagay yung mga, oh my gosh, pinandito mga drawing to start up. <laughs> so, yan, aking yellow pad. So, usually talaga nagdadala talaga yung yellow pad yung face to face. Then, dito ko nilalagay usually yung mga handouts. So, technically, ala na siya dito kasi naayos ko na siya dito sa aking mga boxes. Then, ayan, nakaikit dito yung mga iba kong drawing sa art appreciation. Basta usually dito lahat nakalagay ng mga files or mga important papers or handouts para ano organize pa din yung mga gamit natin. I don't usually have notebook or yung feeler katulad ng sa iba na every subject meron. Basta what important to me is I have my planner. So this is my planner. Kasi sinusulat ko diyan minsan yung kung tip ko mag lecture ganyan so dito ako nag lecture Usually I'm also bringing extra shirt kapag may activity ganyan. So, para fresh pa din ako. <laughs> then, next naman, ito na sa pinaka-main. But before that, ayan, usually water or blue or pokari or something. Ayan yung water ko. So, ito na. <laughs> Pagbukas mo ng bag ko, it's like a market. Pumagpag mo siya ng food. <laughs> but then, ito talaga yung totoong laman ng bag ko kapag may pasok. So, first, dito sa taas is my student handbook. Then, bookmarks. JPIA. From JPIA. Have here my umbrella. Then, brush. Hair brush. And my school ID. And, here, um, lots of flush drives. Kailangan ko yan. Lalo na nung nasa student council pa. And, my... for travel. Of course, my essentials. Alcohol. Perfume. Um, what else? My lipstick. My favorite shade. And feminine wipes. And cleansing wipes. Then tissue. Yeah. So yun. Then... <laughs> oh my gosh. Sticky notes, yan. Sticky notes. I really need that. Lalo na pa nagbabasa ng libro. My ball pen. Then, a lot of highlighters. Highlighters. Then, another. Sticky notes. Then, so this is the best part. Hindi ako nawawala ng pagkain sa bar. So, I have yung Opal, which is my favorite. And Chocomalos. And then, Ding Dong. Ayan, shout out to my friends. Figures nila to. Then, of course, chocolate. Then, what else? Yuffle. Usually, kapag pumpasok ako, may clothes talaga. Or sometimes, nakalagay siya sa proper wear. Kung papaya ba siya, or pinya, yun usually yung baon ko. And, lunch din. Minsan nagbabaon ko lunch. Then, yun minsan, orange. Yun, gano'n. Or sometimes, I buy yogurt sa convenience store before ako pumasok. Then, I have here cheesecake. And, I really miss my 
juicy things. Chocolates again. And of course, nuts. So yeah, yun lahat naman yung bago. Para akong nagbebenta. <laughs> but then, yun talaga yun naman yung bago. Parang mas okay na sa akin na busog ako. Kahit na stress, okay lang yun. Then yun, uh, kasha pa dito to eh. May sweater, yan. Kasi na lamig sa room namin. Lalo na pag bear months. And this is my book. So, yung second year ako ng face-to-face pa bago mag-lockdown. Usually, yung tatlong book na to. Dala-dala ko lang siya. Hawa ko lang siya. As long as my foods are, you know, secured to my bag. <laughs> so, ganun yung usually nangyari. And I really miss my, you know, classmates. Kasi, lalo na may seatmates. Alam nila yan. Kapag nag-aamoy orange na yung classroom, they know na nasa likod lang yung kumakain. <laughs> yung mga nasa room lang sa likod yung kumakain. So, alam nila lahat yan. So, I really miss you guys. And congratulations for year na tayo. <laughs> So that's all. That's what's inside my bag, and I hope na somehow may natutunan kayo or may nakuha kayo idea on how you can stay organized even online class. So yon, I advise na if you still have your own school bag, you can still use it, but highly recommend that you should have your own space, any corner inside your home na designated kung saan ka mag-aaral. Kasi mas okay yun. You stay organized na alam nung body mo kung saan part ng house nyo na you have to focus or you have to study, ganyan. Kasi karamihan ng iba woke up like this. Like, nagpa-online class sila sa kwarto, ganyan, sa bed nila. I guess, makakatulong din kung may specific corner kayo sa bahay kung saan kayo mag-aaral. Kasi parang na-equip yung body nyo kung kailan kayo mag-focus. About using your school bag, I guess, kung wala kayong designated study corner, use your bag to stay organized. Still, there is a sense of obligation to study. Diba? Pag nakita nyo yung bag nyo, oh, I have to study ganyan, I have to read. So, para nare-remind din kayo. Kasi na-experience ko din nung online class na I don't know where to start, like I'm being productive ba, may nagagawa ba ako like parang I'm just doing it for compliance Ganun. lalo na kapag accountancy student ka diba, kailangan talaga na re-retain yung mga tinututo and yung mga natututunan natin not just for compliance, kasi ang hirap yun is, this is also a preparation for board exam, so kaya seryosohin na yung bawat subjects and study hard until the next video. Bye!